Welcome to the I-14 Sports Report, heard right here on KNCT-FM. Listener supported public radio over Central Texas for almost 50 years, or KNCT.org online. Help support us, keep us online here at KNCT-FM. We bring in lots of great programming, lots of great music, and also high school football for almost 45 years we've been reading that high school, local high school football. So community step up, if you will. Go online, knct.org, and pledge your support. Appreciate that. You can hear all the I-14 Sports programs on I-14 Sports, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Also, YouTube channel. We just need 10 more subscribers. We can stream live if you'll help us out there. Go subscribe to our YouTube channel. Just search for the letter I, the number 14 Sports, and it'll take you right there. You can find us on any platform. Getting out the local news about these great kids here in Central Texas. Seven on seven going on. Ellison taking on Coppers Cove um, on the 21st over at Leo Buckley. Then on the 28th, they'll be at Coppers Cove um, taking on those Bulldogs over there. Also, we got that summer baseball going on with Harker Heights involved. Also, some other teams from the area, Colleen High, Coppers Cove, Temple. Select teams also with some local kids on there, too. You're going to notice of some of those kids. Um, check it out. Uh, most of those games played at Harker Heights High School, so more information on that. Check out their Facebook page. Local camps going on. Of course, root camps going on. You can find out uh, some more information. Contact Coach Maurice Lane over at Colleen High, and he'll give you more information on all the camps that are going on over Colleen High. Also, Harker Heights. Information on the camps going on at Harker Heights for boys and girls. Harker Heights Knights Court.com. We've also got Mary Harden Baylor doing some baseball camps. Crewathletics.com. Crewathletics.com slash camps. For more information on that. Folks from uh, Tarleton State University, the Todd Witten football camps going on. Oh, at Harker Heights High School, it's going to be going on July the 14th. More information, you can contact the folks uh, there uh, at the uh, Mary Hart, excuse me, at uh, Tarleton or at Harker Heights High School. All right. Also, uh, speaking of Harker Heights High School, Texas High School Baseball Coaches Association All Star Game going on at Dell Diamond. 18th and the 19th, and Mr. Easton Culp will be there. Congratulations to Easton on making that squad. Also, Shoemaker won the Lineman Challenge. We forgot to tell you about that last week. Got some videos up for you on Facebook also. Uh, no other KISD schools were involved with this. Lake Belton finished second, though. Georgetown was third. Belton was fourth. Also, their silver team also qualified in the, uh, another division. So congratulations to the Shoemaker kids. Uh, UIL had their annual meeting. They're not going to be... Um, Adding a shot clock. I uh, won't be switching soccer to a fall sport. Some, a lot of folks were wanting that to happen. Also, they're going to let freshmen continue to play varsity sports. Also a good move there for the kids. Crusader Stadium is going to be changing its name to Friedenberg Stadium after Coach Pete. After he two, won two national championships in nine years. And was a great, great coach over there. And that will be going on coming up in the fall. Speaking of coaches, brand new coach over Colleen High, Josh Sadler is the new athletic coordinator and head coach for the Kangaroos, and he is uh, a guy uh, just recently over at Temple High School. He also has coached at Liberty High School in Liberty, Texas, and in Sheldon, Texas at C.E. King High School. Looking forward to meeting uh, with Coach Sadler. Welcome to Rue Country, uh, Coach Sadler. And uh, also I want to tell you about Cameron Delaney playing in a basketball tournament uh, for professional players. It's called the tournament. And he'll be playing for a team that is called the Men of Mackey. Uh, a lot of these teams are based around Purdue University, so that's what that's all about. So it'll be uh, interesting to see Cameron in that. Good luck to that. Good luck to Cameron as he continues his basketball career. 
Uh, we got that uh, schedule is online for all the games that are going to be taking place. We'll have the broadcast schedule up as soon as we get it together. Looking for sponsors right now for KISD football. We need sponsors. Um, if you want more information on becoming a sponsor of KISD football, uh, probably almost 20 broadcasts of KISD football live on 91.3, uh, broadcast to all of Central Texas. Um, more information, go to i14sportsinfo at gmail.com and say, yes, I want more information on sponsoring football. So, interested in sponsoring football this year? Here on KNCTFM, that's where the money's going to go, right back here to this radio station. Uh, it'll be the address i14sportsinfo at gmail.com. And of course, like I said, call KNCT right now and make that pledge of support. Go online to knct.org. Make that pledge. You can find out all, all their blogs, all of their programs on myknct.com if you want to do that. And if you got more information for me, send it to i14sportsinfo at gmail.com. I'll be sure and get it on the air. And, of course, supporting Central Texas is what we're all about. So, a lot of stuff going on. Uh, if you need more information, uh, go ahead and give us a holler at i14sportsinfo at gmail.com or at Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And we will see you later. You have a great weekend coming up. And stay cool.